Let's look at another example with a deck of cards here. So you draw one card from a normal 52 card deck. D is the event that you draw a diamond. Q is the event you draw a queen. And B is the event that you draw a black card. Are the following independent? So queen and diamond. So remember, here's our definition of independence. Probability of A given B has to be the same as probability of A. Second event has no effect. So we want to check and see is the probability of a queen given a diamond, is that the same as just the probability of drawing a queen? Well, probability of drawing a queen, if we go to our deck of cards, there are four queens right here out of 52 cards. So queen is 4 out of 52. Now probability of drawing a queen, given that it's a diamond. So then this is saying, well, you're only considering diamonds. So you're only considering these 13 cards at your restricted total outcomes. And we want to know how many queens out of those uh, 13 cards. I'm sorry, 13 cards. Uh, there's one queen. So the given event, diamonds, determines our denominator. And then out of those 13, how many satisfy the first event? One. Well, 4 out of 52, that's the same as 1 out of 13. These two probabilities are equal. OK, so since these equal, those two events are independent. Uh, how about diamond black? So we want to ask, is the probability of a diamond, uh, given that it's black, does that equal the probability of a diamond? Well, probability of a diamond, go back to our deck of cards. So here's our diamonds. There are 13 of those, 13 of each suit, out of 52 total. So diamond is 13 out of 52, which is 1 fourth. And then let's look at probability of diamond given black. So the given event restricts your total outcomes. So it's given that it's black, so we're only considering black cards. So black cards, there's 13 clubs and 13 spades. So that's 26. And then we want to know what's the probability it's a diamond if it's one of those 26 cards. Well, those 26 black cards, none of those are diamonds. Diamonds are right here. So this is zero diamonds out of 32 black cards. I'm sorry, 26 black cards. Because um, diamonds are red. So this is zero. And we can see that. Uh, zero here is not equal to one fourth. So these two events are dependent. So if the two probabilities are equal, they're independent. If they're not equal, the events are dependent.